What's up YouTube? It's Wonderfully Untamed and I'm on for a few minutes to update you on a couple of things. One is that I've been nominated to as a finalist in the Natural Heart Awards. And I, this was just news to me today. I was on the computer earlier and got a message in my YouTube email telling me that I was a finalist. And I was like, whoa, <laughs> who's nominating me? Um, I remember one of my subscribers, um, I think it was Gracefully, oh no, I'm sorry if I'm forgetting your name. I know it's Graceful, Graceful something, um, who let me know in the um, last video that I uploaded after I pressed my hair that she had nominated me for this. And I was like, wow, what is that? You know, tell me more about it. So she told me a little bit about it, but before that, I really hadn't heard of it. Um, but I got this email today from um, one of the sponsors of the contest telling me that I'm a finalist. So I was like, okay. Okay, so I just wanted to tell you guys about that. There's um, a way to vote. Um, I'm contestant number seven in the category of, um, I think the category is called greatest hair length. No, it's like greatest length achievement. Um, category and it the contest is for um, for youtubers who have less than YouTube natural hair youtubers who have less than a thousand subscribers um, and who I guess are just doing great things in certain categories so I just want to say thank you for anyone out there who nominated me in the finalist contest I'm contestant number seven so if you're gonna vote for me go to the Natural Heart Awards channel on YouTube. They have their rules for how you can vote. Um, and then you just need to, in the comment section, put that you're voting for number seven, Wonderfully Untamed. So that's cool. That, that made me happy today. You always get happy to hear about, you know, things like that. So I appreciate that. Second was to, tell, to show you guys <laughs> my hair since the press. You know, because we're always sensitive about putting heat on our hair. We want to make sure, you know, things are going to go back to natural. And this did with no problems at all. Um, I am going to upload another video about my whole process for washing my hair, especially after I've had it pressed and all that. Nothing scientific. Um, but it's just helpful for people to know. And I've actually, when I was in California and people saw my hair, um, the length that it was, they were shocked, couldn't believe it. And I got a lot of questions about what I do just for maintenance. So I'm going to do a, a regular video about it. And it, trust me, it's nothing complicated, just a few basics. So I'll do that. Um, but otherwise, just want you to see um, how things turned out after the press. Um, and then some of you asked me for the name of the place where I got my hair pressed, especially some of the YouTubers who are here in Houston. And that place was called For the Root of You in Houston. Um, and I posted that as a response to the few um, subscribers who asked me. So check it out. Let them know I sent you. <laughs> um, and the stylist that I had there, her name was Princetta. Um, sweet lady. Okay, so that's it. Last look. If you have any questions, you know you can always ask, guys, and I will talk to you again soon. Bye for now.